Hey guys, what's up? Well, this video is going to be about a cheap DIY laser module from a no computer DVD writer. I need such a laser dial for my CNC and gimbal project. I found it very expensive on the internet, so I decided to make my own. You can see that how powerful it is. It is making quite deep burns in the wood. So let's get started. The key component of this project is this laser diode which I salvage out from an old DVD driver. So let's look at the basic principle of this diode. Here we have our diode which is spreading all the radiations but they are not focused at a point. So what are we going to do is to use two lenses. This is a concave lens. We are focusing this radiation in a straight line. You can see this lens is here in the DVD driver lens and the unknown lens is a plano convex lens which is focus these all the radiation in a single point so you can see this here this tiny little lens with some magnets to focus this beam on the DVD and I am also using a heatsink from an old motherboard I also got that aluminum tube which is the inner diameter of 7 mm and having a length about 13.3 mm. I am going to use these two tubes to set all two lenses. You can see the one lens is here. I salvage out this lens from an old laser pointer. You can see this lens is here. And the another I salvage out from the laser module of this drive driver. You can see this here. So it's time to assemble this. I am gluing this laser, laser diode directly to the heatsink. I know it's not the best idea. But just probably work fine. I am assembling this lens. First, place a con plano convex lens and then insert the tube outside this thing. Then, I am going to use a spacer to separate these two lenses. Basically, it's a paper. I am going to round it and then just put it inside to separate these two lenses. As you can see here, now I am going to place this another convex lens. Now the assembly of our lens is complete. I am gluing this directly to the heatsink. I also settled that the center of this laser diode is exactly in the center of this lens tube. I also soldered three wires on this diode. So let's power it up. I am going to power it up with three volts at 500 milliamperes. More than that, this diode may burn. Just take out that dead sheet of your diode, which you are going to use. You can see that this is burning paper very fast. Safety is always first priority, so don't forget to wear safety glasses. 
otherwise constant watching of this laser pointer might burn your retina so let's add some cool stuff with it you can see it is burning mdf i'm going to use this laser arrow for my next cnc engraver project i also put a link in the description for my instructables check it out If you like my video thumbs up and don't forget to like share and subscribe stay creative and we will meet in next video